This was just a silly video based on a Twitter thread this morning. I had an x-ray source, I had some diodes and I had a bit of free time. So um, I decided to put the two together. I'll put a link to the Twitter thread down in the video description so uh, anybody that's interested can follow along. But this was just a, a sort of half hour experiment towards the end of the day. Trying out using standard diodes as x-ray detectors. Our current detection is with a large area, uh, large surface area photodiode and it just goes into this box which is a, a, a quick and dirty trans impedance amplifier. We don't actually care so much in our application about absolute values, it's just relative changes. So if I switch, if I open the shutter on the x-ray source, we see a signal. This is the x-ray image of the photodiode we use for detecting and aligning the x-ray source. This is just an x-ray image of the 1N4007 diode mounted up for a testing. Replace our large area photodiode with a 1N4007 which is mounted here and just attached with crocodile clips. Close the door up. Turn on x-rays. So all these experiments are being done with uh, an x-ray voltage of 90 kilovolts and uh, a tube current of 180 microamps. So about 16 watts or so on the target. So again, I'll snap an image and we get an image of the diode. And if we now look at the light meter, we'll look at the uh, trans impedance amplifier, open the shutter, we see the diode is detecting proof.